Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all had a wonderful New Year's and holiday season. I am excited for this new year and I'm really excited to be more consistent on YouTube. Excited to see what this new year holds. Today I thought I would film a what I got for Christmas haul. I know Christmas was over a week ago, but I wanted to show you guys what I got. I just want to put it out there as a little disclaimer. I don't want to come off as bragging or anything. I personally love to watch videos like this, so hopefully you guys get some inspiration from this video. I picked out my favorite items that I got, so let's get started. The first thing I got was from Aritzia. I know everyone and their mother has the Molina pans. I do too. I have the black ones. But I saw they came out with this snake. I don't know if you guys can tell but it's like a croc snake print effect Molina pant. And I thought it was so cool. And I love how it's a different take on the leather pant, but I did get it in the black color. I believe it comes in two other shades. I know these stretch, so you want to size down one size, but it has the silver hardware and they are absolutely gorgeous. They're just a straight leg leather pant, and I will try these on for you guys. Next, I got a pair of Moon Moods. I already own a black pair, but I got super excited because I got the cream version. This is what these look like. These cream Moon Boots are super cute and also will be really nice to style with, like jeans or just black in general. Next, I got the Baccarat Rouge 540 by Mason Francis. Not gonna even try to pronounce that last one. I feel like everyone has this perfume or recently got it because this blew up on TikTok. I haven't even opened it because I wanted to open it with you guys, but. So this is what it looks like. You guys have probably all seen this before. It smells so nice. I am so excited to use this but I'm super grateful for receiving this for Christmas. I've really been looking to find like my scent in perfumes cause I do like to mix and match, but also it would be really nice to like have your go-to. So hopefully that can be that. Next, I received this bag right here. I feel like silver or like shiny bags have been really in this winter and fall. And this isn't a sequin bag, but these are actually shiny beads, silver beads. But I really like this because it complements every outfit day or night. And also, it is so cute. I really wanted a shiny bag for the winter season. So this is going to be absolutely perfect. Next, I got this Y mug from Anthropology, And it's just this monogram Y. And I've been wanting it for a while now just because I feel like it's so hard to find a mug with the letter Y on it, but I got it and can't wait to drink some matcha or some coffee out of it. The next thing I got is this really adorable Stony Clover Lane makeup bag. It's a velvet material and it's a really big size if you guys can tell. I love Stony Clover Lane and all of their products. I think they do pouches and bags so fun and so cute. You can personalize them. I already own a bunch of their pouches. I thought this pink ruffled one would be a really nice addition to my collection. I don't know exactly what I'm going to put in there because I already have my makeup one and since this is more of a velvet texture, I think maybe I'll do as a carry-on bag or something like that. I'm not exactly sure, but I have a bunch of their pouches already and I'm so excited about this one. Next, I have a pair of Uggs slippers that I got. Uggs have definitely been more in season this year or these past two seasons. I think it's awesome because I feel like I've been wearing Uggs for so long. And even when Uggs weren't in style, I still wore them all the time. I think they are the comfiest shoe ever. I was Uggs ride or die from the beginning, I'ma be honest. But I currently have a pair of Uggs slippers, but they are on their last end. So I got these for Christmas. I am so excited about them. They are the classic chestnut color with the little shearling right here. I am obsessed with it and they look so comfy. This next item I've been talking about for a while that I've been wanting and it was high on my Christmas list just because I felt like this was gonna be so cute. Let me paint the picture. Imagine this on your countertop. Such a cute appliance, hint, hint. And I just thought it was super chic. A lot of people were raving about this item, so I got the Beast Blender for Christmas. I am absolutely in love with it. It works so well. I also got this extra attachment 
It came with this cap as well. Also, it came with this top if you want to take your smoothie to go. Not only does this blender look so aesthetically pleasing, but also it works super well. And I am so excited. I think this is so nice to like store away in your fridge or grab on the go. I'm really excited to upgrade from my other blender to the Beast Blender. I feel like I am definitely growing up and getting older because I get more excited about appliances, but the next item is the Our Place Always Pan, and I am so excited about this. I haven't used it yet because I wanted to show you guys like it straight from the box, but it came with like all these things and instructions, but like a little steamer for dumplings, veggies, the whole gist. I wanted the black one specifically just because I thought it would match everything, like the blender, and it was a good neutral tone. I'm super excited to get more into cooking because I love to cook, and hopefully I get to show you guys some recipes that I have been cooking away. I feel like this holiday I have been cooking a lot. If you guys are interested, I can definitely do that. I'm so excited about this pan. Don't get me wrong, I love my stainless steel pan that I have, but always pan is gonna hit different. Last but not least is definitely the banger of the whole haul in my opinion. I am so grateful that I was able to get this for Christmas. I feel like everyone already owns this by now, but I wasn't exactly sure if I wanted this item previously just because I didn't know if I could rock the loafer look, if that gives you guys a hint. But I got a pair of Prada shoes for Christmas. I am so grateful for this and so excited about these. These are what they look like. I feel like they are just the classic leather Prada loafers that have been super popular. This will be my first high-end pair of shoes like this. I feel like it's really hard for me to want a high-end shoe just because I'm so afraid of getting them dirty or ruining them, but I feel like these are such a stable and I'm so so grateful and excited to style these. So that is the end of the haul. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It would really help me out. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok where I have been posting more content. It will be listed down below and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.